Welcome to part one of the CLM reporting tutorial series. This is an introduction to report authoring for CLM users using Rational Reporting for Development Intelligence, or RRDI. In this part, I'll compare the two report authoring tools, Query Studio and Report Studio, and show you how to launch them. This diagram shows an overview of Rational Reporting for Development Intelligence, or RRDI. All reports are stored and displayed in Cognos Connection, but the report viewer will most likely view reports through the Rational CLM user interface. RRDI report authors will use Cognos Connection to see reports and dashboards, to launch tools for report authoring, and to access Cognos and Rational help content. I'll focus on Cognos Query Studio and Cognos Report Studio report authoring tools since they will probably be the most common for authoring CLM reports. Let's compare Report Studio and Query Studio. They're both web-based report authoring tools, but Report Studio allows you to create multiple page complicated reports and dashboards, while Query Studio allows you to create simple queries and reports and to validate data. Report Studio has a more complex interface and more reporting capabilities and features than Query Studio. In Report Studio, you create a report, then you run it in order to see the data. But in Query Studio, as soon as you create the queries in the report, the query is run and the data is generated and visible. Report Studio also has more analytical features than Query Studio. In Query Studio, you connect to a data source to view the data. The data is displayed in a tree hierarchy, and you can expand the tree to select data items for your report. You can use the data source to create reports that can then be saved and reused. You can also create a new report by opening an existing report, changing it, and saving it under another name. You can change the appearance of reports to improve the layout of your report, for example, you can create a chart, add a title, specify text and border styles, or reorder columns for easy comparison. You can compare and analyze data in the report by using filters, summaries, and calculations. You can also drill up and drill down to view related information. You can print a report or save it in another format, such as PDF. You can use Query Studio to create these types of reports and charts. First, list reports are simple reports in column format. You can insert and format columns, move them around, add a report title, and change fonts. Second, crosstab reports show data in both rows and columns so that you can analyze the data in relation to both. The values at the intersection points of rows and columns show summarized information rather than detailed information. You can create a crosstab report, rotate rows and columns, insert a column into a crosstab, create sections, and apply templates. Third, charts can be created from an existing report. Query Studio includes a selection of chart types that work with one or more columns of numeric data. You can view charts with or without the report information. You can create a column chart, hide the menu, create a pie chart, and move columns around. In the graphics, you can see examples of Query Studio reports and charts. Report Studio is a web-based professional report authoring tool used to build sophisticated reports. Some things you can do are create multiple page reports, create charts, list reports, cross tabs and maps, add user prompts that act as questions to help users customize the information in a report to suit their own needs, Apply filters to retrieve a specific subset of records. Apply calculations to create a new value from existing values contained within a data item. Use drill-throughs to create a network of linked reports so your user can move between different reports while focusing on one piece of data. Use conditional styles to bring attention to patterns in the data. Run the report in different formats while you're creating it. Read and edit Query Studio reports, but note that you cannot edit Report Studio reports in Query Studio. These are two simple Report Studio reports. 
Report 1 includes a prompt that asks the user to select a project area. The pie chart then shows data related to that project. Report 2 includes conditional formatting so that the user can immediately see areas that need attention. The IBM Cognos Connection web portal is a single point of access to all IBM Cognos content. Start your web browser and type in the URL supplied by your administrator. You'll be prompted to log in with a name and a password. A good tip is to create a bookmark in your browser for quick access to the portal. Once you're in the portal, you can launch Query Studio and Report Studio by selecting the Launch menu.